Hi, I'm Miranda Lyon with Eminem Horsemanship, and I was going to give you guys a little bit of a demonstration on a nice quick knot that we have. The bank robber knots is what we call it. So this knot is something that we'll use to tie a horse up kind of quick, something you can really take a good release on pretty fast if you need to. So if you need to go rob a bank, you can tie your horse up pretty fast, uh, get in, and get out of that bank as fast as you can. That's why they call it the bank robber knot. All right, so for the bank robber knot, we've got our, our lead rope here. We're going to take it. We're going to loop it in half. We're going to either stick it through a ring or around a post, whatever you're securing your horse to. And we've got the horse side here. I've got my tail side here. What we're going to start with is take that horse side, and we're going to stick that horse side through that loop that you just took through or around. You're going to pull it tight with that tail side. So you're going to take this tail side, you're going to stick it through that loop of your horse side, and you're going to pull that horse side a little bit snug there. So make sure you leave just a little bit extra of a loop there or a little bit room that you need to take a little bit back to your horse. Not too much, depends how big of that loop you take, and then pull back to your horse. Just so you find the right length you want to tie your horse at. So whenever you come through here and you want to untie your horse or if you need that quick release knot, if you pull on this rope here, you're going to untie that. And for this being called the bank robber knot, if you always watch the old westerns, whenever you come running at your horse with a bag full of cash out of the bank real fast and people are shooting at you, your horse usually will pull back just a little bit. So when they're pulling back, they actually pull themselves loose too. So as you pull that first one, they pull the second one, or it'll just come loose whenever you need to let it come loose. You can kind of pull that. Usually it'll fall out just with a little bit of a jiggle, or you just pull on your horse's side easy too. So that's something to play with. Whenever you want to make this a little bit more of a secure knot and your horse plays with the rope a little bit, you're going to take that horse side back through that loop again. You're going to take that tail side back through that horse loop. Pull it tight. This is where we left off before. Now if you want to, make, take this one just a little bit more longer. You're going to take your horse side of your loop and you can make a, a loop in it by rolling it up or under, whichever one. So just like the bowlin we have in the other video, you'll take this loop that you have extra through that and it'll stay in there. If you take it through the back side, it'll come out. So just make sure you make that loop, take your excess loop through there, tighten it down a little bit. That makes the horse kind of pull on that loop a little bit more. That way they can't really pull on it, get it too loose. And if your horse fiddles with that rope a lot, take it through that loop, that tail end through that loop, so that if they pull on it, they'll just pull this loop to this tail end rope. So they won't really pull themselves loose. But when you're ready, even if you have this secure knot here, take that loop, take that tail end back out of that loop and just pull on it yourself. You don't have to take it all out and you can let your horse go. Quick release knot, that's the bank robber knot.